Ubuntu means I need you in order for me to be me. As you need me in order for you to be you. It is saying, really, we are bound up together. Because you see, I wouldn't know how to speak like a human being. I wouldn't know how to walk like a human being. I wouldn't know how to think like a human being. All of these things I learn from other human beings. So I actually need other human beings in order for me to be human. And in a nutshell we say, a person is a person through other persons. Really, it is saying you and I and all of us are members of one family. You can understand that. You are my brother. She is your sister. People all over the world, whether, whether their complexion is dark like mine, light like yours, we are really members of the human family. And you won't want to hurt your sister, your brother. You don't stab your sister or your brother. You won't want them to stab you. And it doesn't usually happen in a family that brothers and sisters kill each other or uh, are violent to each, each other. When that happens, there is something wrong in the family. So you young people, the, his, the future of the world is in your hands. Whether it is going to become a caring world or an uncaring world, cruel, it all depends on you. Is it going to be a world where you want your children to grow up? A world with kind people, with compassionate people, with gentle people? You decide. It is in your hands. Young people must dream. Young people must dream about a world where there is no poverty, where there is no war, where there is no fighting, where there is no disease, where children will have enough water to drink, will have enough food to eat everywhere in the world. It is possible. And I would want to see young people say, we dream of a world like this one.